right now I'm here with uh, Dolakpo and um, we, just, <laughs> we just finished joining the first uh, yeah. uh, five matches played, waiting for the last one for the day. That, that's the second match between Aston Villa versus West Ham. But hey, so far so good. We've seen these five matches from the one from Liverpool. We've seen Arsenal, we saw Everton, we saw Brighton. And uh, which of these uh, matches do you think uh, actually uh, impressed you so much? I must say um, the Liverpool game. Right. The Liverpool game. After yeah. losing out of um, with Jogging Club, mm. a new coach came in, uh, and a slot. In and mm. a slot from a different league. Mm. Yeah. And you know, same, although mm. same mm. setup of players, mm. but really impressed with the second half. At the mm. first half, I was like, man, is this Liverpool ready to compete with um, Man City? But with the second half performance, mm. they gave a winning mentality. All right, two new two coaches from um, from a different league, like Osla from Brighton. We saw him give uh, Everton today 4-0, just like an slot um, oh. um, uh, uh, for, uh, Liverpool, um, for Liverpool also yes, winning yes, today. Yes, yes, you know, um, does, does it tell that um, uh, Premier League is easy? Not really, not really. I won't say that because um, <laughs> the Everton case is a different one. We know mm. everything that happened with them. The mm. last season scenario, still bringing it into this new season. And mm. I had um, the a possibility of them deducting 16 points again. Again, this is what so all this. You know all this problem here yeah, and there, maybe some spiritual problem. <laughs> and Brighton saw it as Village people. Yeah, Brighton saw it as a easy step for them. So, <laughs> all right, yeah, we, we, we saw Arsenal today again, again, get going, getting two goals, getting maximum three points, you know, still maybe probably remembering second or third in the table. And last season, they were behind uh, Manchester City, pushing Manchester City. Uh, do you see them uh, so, uh, you know, going past Manchester City for the first time? After you know, after the, all the struggle for uh, this season. Well, I think um, the coach already said it all. If you want to win the league for Man City, you need to get 100 points. So probably if he's able to achieve what he said, then. But 100 points is it possible? <sighs> Who says it's not? Hmm. Mathematically, it's possible. So if they work towards it, they can. All right, all right. What well, for your personally? Personally, what do you think Arsenal has actually done well this season that uh, was absent last season? Well, I think um, the match I saw mm. that I just finished is almost the same set of players like last season. So mm. it's the same thing. It's mm. just a matter of them getting it right and not mm. sleeping during the die stage of the season mm. as they did last season and not past season. Mm. All right, can you just this um, this match I just ended now? Can you just give me like two Arsenal players that impressed you so much in this game? You know, two Arsenal players that you see, oh, they really tried, they really try. You want to rate them high? I it think um, I will really. Firstly, I'll go with um, Timba. Timba. He came in, he yeah. played like 15 minutes after that long time off. Yeah. And with this performance, it's someone you really can feel, yes. And mm. secondly, I think Pate. When the Clarice left the field, I was like, oh, this midfield, the whole pressure will be so big on him. But big man on his own game. Mm. And he really matched up the midfield and gave a fantastic. All right, Dolly, Dolly, Dolly. Thank you very much for granting us this interview. No, Have a nice day. Have a nice day. Yeah.